We ain't gonna go there with children. We're talking about being rich, honey. We're not gonna go there with the children. So you wanna back up the whole kitty thing? We're talking. Mad Saint Quetic man, a girl was having sin. Mad Saint Quetic man, a girl was having sin. I wouldn't stoop to your love and go with the kid thing, okay? Yeah, y'all. If I find out, if it plays out on a show, or if Melody or Martell come on record and confirm that Miss Wanda was saying something about their children, I'm going to have to sign that petition too. You know, I was trying to wait to hear everything comes out, hear, you know, what everybody has to say about the actual altercation from their mouth. But if it comes out that Miss Wanda says something about the Eminem clan, I got to sign that petition too. Because we don't talk about kids. Like, especially, like, for me, I feel like with reality TV show as a whole, if the people that you're talking about are not, like, main characters on the show, I feel like you shouldn't talk about them. I feel almost the same way about people's husbands. Like, if the husbands aren't, like, main, or husbands or wife aren't, like, main characters on the show, why bring that up? Because a lot of times, you know, as family members, they're just trying to support, you know, their family, the star of the show. So I feel like they're innocent so just leave them out of it like what does it bring to you miss wanda to talk about somebody's kids or try to question anybody's paternity that's that shouldn't be none of your concern like why do you want to bring drama and hurt like to me that's somebody that has like some some things going on within themselves because why would you want to bring that kind of energy like like a disruptive stirring the pot kind of energy like sometimes it's okay oh fine interesting for this show but you know once it becomes like personal people are getting alter altercations behind it it's like now you're going too far and again like i said we are all kind of speculating and trying to put all the pieces together from what is out there from what is seen but if it is if it is as people are deducing it to and it was because miss wanda was saying something about paternity and stuff like that mm -mm. It's time to it's time to let her go. That's how come I had to use that clip of Nene in the beginning because Nene broke Sheree down in a way that hasn't been I have yet to see when it comes down to get like just stop it. Don't don't do that, you know? <laughs> like, don't talk about my daughter. Don't talk about my daughter. Where that went? What's her um when uh what's her name? OG off of Basswell's wife was mocking uh Evelyn and it's true like don't talk about people's kids like we not about to do that and I just feel like it's not necessary and I want to keep the same energy for um the Scott's kids like I don't want nobody to talk about them either and I'm pretty sure Wanda would not like that as well so I just feel like don't talk about the Scott kids the uh Hawk clan we're not doing none of that and just to hear Miss Wanda actually did that it's just it's mm, it's just rubbing me the wrong way um just keep it to what's going on in the show but once you bring kids involved it's not right and i just feel like as an elder she knows that she should know better and i think that's where people are like are coming down on her and you know people are saying things like i i'm she's not a type of elder i would respect see because she's not carrying herself like in the way of having wisdom and knowledge and trying to help the youth like bring people up farther it's like she's down in the gutter with everybody else with people like half her age or young you know she's acting like a young like i'm sorry marceau said it right like one thing about it marceau be having miss wanda paid correctly like she is not acting like an adult she's not acting her age listen i cannot control a grown woman well you know the funny thing is right now she's not acting like a grown woman and i just don't like how teachers sitting back just allowing this to happen um i feel like like they say it's a way to talk to your parents to show respect but and she and tisha can do that and it's just like when Tisha is silent, it's kind of like she is co-signing her mom's behavior. Even though I feel like she knows her mom's behavior is bogus. And that's just like, ooh, just like ring your mom in. Like, I, just look how Miss Van is. And even Martell mom, like we've seen other moms on the show. They show their face. They say what they need to say. They get their advice. And that's it. They don't be nitpicking with other cast, me with, with other cast members. Like, they're just there to be a mom to their child that's it like not getting in their ch children's business it's and, and it just don't even fit because like i said miss wanda is an elder she don't need to be in all the scenes because these people are like younger than her unless she's going to be like you know the mama with like she's going to be giving wisdom than uh, dropping gems but she talking about 
trusting somebody that don't buy the same shoes out of the box. I don't even know what that means, y'all. Can y'all help me figure out what that means? I do not know what that means. Maybe I should Google what that means because I have no clue. I never heard that before. <laughs> like one of them, uh, uh, colloquial, what's the word? Colloquialisms? I don't know. One of those, uh, uh, Negro spiritual, um, sayings. I don't know, but <laughs> this one to like chill out. But I want to know what y'all think. Are y'all gonna sign that petition? Is y'all gonna write y'all name on the dotted line? I want to see how many, um, signatures they had so far, but it is crazy. Like, don't talk about the hog kids because you know those they are so cute and beautiful like you know they like touched my heart last season when they were talking about their parents and not really you know wanting to see them divorce and they were just so articulate i'm like whoa these kids are amazing like and that's how come i i know y'all don't like it but it's 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 because of them alone that i have like some compassion for martel because they love him from what i see and i just i'm like okay i know like y'all said he can't be that much of a great father if he's treating the mom bad but like i i feel like i just can give him that because i don't know i just think their kids are beautiful and so are the sky's kids like i just think kids are all beautiful and they should be off limits it's, it's almost like i'm feeling like miss wanda is kind of jealous or something because i don't i don't get that I just don't get it. Even when she was making comments about their, like, um, I think a couple seasons ago about hair textures and stuff. Like, why? I I don't get it. But <laughs> maybe y'all can help me. I'm open to learning and growing. <laughs> That's what we do on this channel. We talk, like, and try to figure things out. But other than that, let me know what y'all think. And I will talk to you guys again soon. Hopefully, you guys can join me again next Saturday for another live. Because that was pretty fun. Like, I really enjoyed talking to you guys. Um, We'll do, like, another live review or whatever. We'll watch the show together. And we can all chime in together. But other than that, I will talk to you guys again soon. Have a blessed day. And I'll talk to you guys again later. Bye.